Police say they've identified human remains found in blankets on Holland Street. Baltimore County officers say they're confident they belong to Charla Melvin. The grandmother disappeared last week. Investigators believe she was the victim of foul play. WJZ is live. Rachel Menetoff has the latest information tonight from Baltimore County Police. Rachel. Max and Abajoy, county police are now investigating this case as a homicide, and they're looking into whether one of Melvin's family members could be responsible. The last time that family saw Charla Melvin was here at her Baltimore County home last weekend. Help her spirit, you know, be released. Sunday night, her family, friends, and loved ones gathered to remember their devoted mother and grandmother. You know, very small in stature, but her spirit was really tall. Throughout the week, detectives canvassed her Windsor Mill neighborhood while Melvin's family pled with the community to come forward with information about her disappearance. This is very unusual for her. On Saturday, police were called to the 2300 block of Holland Street in West Baltimore, where they found remains wrapped in blankets and plastic. Police tell WJZ the body had suffered obvious trauma and that they're pretty confident the remains belong to Charla Melvin, but they're awaiting the results of an autopsy to be absolutely certain. We're going to continue to wait uh, for the autopsy to be completed, uh, see what the manner and the cause of death was, and then work our way into the evidence that we do have to try to determine exactly who was responsible for it. Corporal Sean Vinson with the Baltimore County Police Department says police suspected Melvin was the victim of foul play after her cousin, Thomas Davis Jr., was found dead of an apparent suicide near Easterwood Park on September 10th. We continue to look at what the MO was that led up to the homicide, uh, but at this point we have evidence that there was some type of conflict between the cousin and Miss Melvin. Melvin's car, a 2017 Hyundai Santa Fe, is still missing. It was last spotted in West Baltimore. Police are asking that people look out for this car with Maryland tags 3CR7429. I know she was low. She was always that bright light. Charla's family now honors her memory, a woman they say inspired everyone around her. Police say if you happen to see Charla Melvin's 2017 Hyundai Santa Fe to please call 911. They believe that her car could be an important piece of evidence in this case. Reporting live, I'm Rachel Menetoff for WJZ.